What's up, survivalists? Jason here. Today, I'm going to do a VR. And this VR goes out to none other than the Fat Man. Oh, yes, the Fat Man. Man, if you don't know the Fat Man, where have you been? Like, seriously, who doesn't know the Fat Man? If you don't know the Fat Man, I'll put a link in the description down below so you can go sup him up. Because if you don't subscribe to him, you will miss out. Such a great guy. Excellent content, excellent videos, and really cool knives. So if you're into knives and sometimes going shooting and all that stuff, go over there and check them out. And uh, for this video, he is having his 1,000 subscriber giveaway. Man, that is some milestone. Congrats, brother. You deserve it. And you deserve more, of course. So here is to a thousand more. So, uh, he had the decency to include me into the giveaway. That means that I am one of the people you have to subscribe to be able to go into the giveaway. Man, that is too much. Thank you. Although, I'm not quite sure how to subscribe to myself. So, uh, for this VR, he wanted us to show our favorite weapon. Now, for me, I don't have that many weapons, per se. I mainly have knives and stuff like that. So, uh, this one knife really caught my eye of actually a weapon. So, uh, my favorite weapon is the CRKT Triumph Neck Knife. Alright, as seen, it's the CRKT Triumph neck knife, and yes, I did do the paracord on there. I left about an inch on there to keep that choil to keep my finger from slipping. So, uh, let me tell you about this knife. This knife was gifted to me by Flint Steel Survival. He just added it in to one of the boxes, which uh, he was doing the leather sheath for me. And man, I gotta say, this totally caught me off guard. But after playing with it a while, and it is used and abused. When I use my knives, I use my knives. But I gotta say, after playing with it, seems like a really great knife. Probably for self-defense. I always carry this now, just right here. Always right next to my canteen every time I'm out in the woods. But, I gotta say, especially with that Tanto blade, that little recurve on there, really cool thumb grip, jimping, whatever you want to call it. Seems like a really great knife. But, the real test is, let me show you what I could do with this knife. Let's go deep into the woods so I can show you. Alright, Tanto blades are usually good for stabbing, so let's simulate some stabbing on this tree. How's that for some good stabbing for ya? Let's see what else we can do. Alright, another good thing about this is it's pretty good after. So uh that's the most things that are pretty cool that you could do with the CRKT Triumph neck knife. Alright, that's some of the things that you do with the CRKT Triumph. And of course, there are other things that you do with it, like batoning, chopping, carving, anything like that, especially pieces like this. But I find those two things the best things that you do with salt defense or just as a weapon. So, uh, I gotta say, the CRKT Triumph is my favorite weapon. And of course, since Flint and Steel Survival gave this to me out of his kindness, I'm gonna pay forward that knife fat man to Flint and Steel Survival. 
Yes, you heard me right. That knife would be going to you if I win, Flint. All because you gave me this knife. So, uh, enjoy if you win. But, uh, I really want to thank you, Flint, for that knife. It's been great. I have used and abused it, of course. But, I gotta say, it's a great knife. And you deserve another great knife just because you gave me this knife. So, uh, I want to thank you for watching and see you next time.